Alec Baldwin will reportedly be returning to the set of Rust to continue filming following the on-set death of the film's cinematographer, Helena Hutchins. The announcement that the actor will return to the set where Helena Hutchins died has caused widespread controversy online, pulling some famous faces into the debate as well. This decision has been branded as ridiculous by journalist Piers Morgan, 57, who aired his opinion on Twitter. Piers slammed the news, sharing an article declaring the decision to keep Alec as Rust's starring actor, simply writing, ridiculous. Alec's supporters bombarded Piers' comment section commanding the journalist to explain himself while others supported his opinion. One person questioned, why? Innocent until proven guilty? Rather than confronting the statement, Piers responded, would you feel comfortable about Alec Baldwin waving a gun around on the set where he killed someone? Many in Piers' comments argued that Helena's death was not Alec's fault but that of the armorer and those involved with organizing the props. One wrote, come on you know better than that, it was an accident and it was the responsibility of someone to make sure the gun Alec had was a prop with blanks whomever brought real ammo on the set is responsible. While another said, I guess it's like blaming a pilot for an engine malfunction. The decision for Alec to return to set was announced shortly after it was confirmed the actor will be charged with involuntary manslaughter. Melina Spadoni, lawyer for Rust Movie Productions, confirmed the film is still on track and will include on-set safety supervisors and union crew members. She also confirmed the project will bar any use of working weapons or any ammunition. In October 2021, the cast and crew of Rust, including Alec Baldwin and cinematographer Helena Hutchin, were setting up for a scene at a ranch on the outskirts of Santa Fe. The actor was pointing a pistol, that was being used as a prop, at Helena when the gun went off, killing the cinematographer and also injuring filmmaker Joel Souza. The Ukrainian was just 42 at the time of her death and is survived by her husband, Matthew Hutchins, and their young son Andros. The Santa Fe District Attorney announced their decision to file involuntary manslaughter charges against the actor through a statement on social media. They also revealed that there will be no charges filed specifically involving Joel Souza, who was also injured in the shooting. District Attorney Mary Carmack Altwies said in the statement, I have determined that there is sufficient evidence to file criminal charges against Alec Baldwin and other members of the Rust film crew.